Good day to you. What exactly does your job entail? I meet with ambassadors from various factions and countries, and cement alliances with them. We are a young cause. Diplomacy is essential to our credibility. Then you speak for the Inquisition with these nobles? I do. Someone must foster goodwill on our behalf, as well as prevent controversy as news of us spreads. How heavily are our actions scrutinized? Make no mistake. Every noble house, every throne, is waiting to see what the Inquisition does next. Many are willing to pledge support, if offers are made in just the right fashion. I intend to see that they are. Tell me how you came to work for the Inquisition again. I'd been considering leaving my post in Antiva for a new challenge when Leliana recruited me. There's such unrest in Thedas, and the Inquisition seems a promising method to stop it. It's to everyone's benefit if we prevent the Mage Templar conflict from spreading further. So was it the prospect of stability that drew you here? The full impact of the Mage Rebellion has yet to be felt. And that was before the death of the Divine. The violence must be curbed before we see it turn to full-scale war. I can only imagine the bloodshed if it escalates further. I'm afraid history holds many examples of what will happen if it does. How do you and Liliana know each other? We moved through similar circles in Norlay. I believe we actually met in Val Royale. Liliana was quite an accomplished player of the game by then. What exactly do you mean when you say the game? Ah, forgive me. The game refers to the slow duels of influence among the noble and powerful of Orlay. It's a rather light-hearted name for the matter, but our legions are fond of playful touches. What business are the Montilliers in, exactly? We began as merchants. My ancestors founded the first trade routes to Rivain. We once sent entire fleets across the Waking Sea. But not anymore. Ah. Uh, these days, our vessels are a touch more modest. That's where our families have met before. Perhaps. Everyone of distinction in the Free Marches attends Lady Trevelyan's summer balls. Great Aunt Lucille always did love a party. I don't recall seeing you at any of them. Attend one ball and you'll fend off invites for a dozen more. That reminds me. The Herald of Andraste has received several invitations from the Curious. To parties? How many am I getting? Only 17 this month, I'm afraid. What did you do before coming here? I had the great honor of serving Antiva's crown as ambassador to Orlais. I'm also first in line to become the head of House Montillier, though my siblings attend to our mercantile affairs. How strong are your past loyalties? I would never have given up my position if I did not intend to fully commit to the Inquisition. We cannot fall back on borders. Antiva is as threatened as any country by the rebellions. If anything, the alliances I forged there may help our current cause. Do you think the Inquisition will continue after we seal the breach? If we prove ourselves by healing the breach, people may turn to us for other things. Protection, counsel, justice. The Inquisition offered these once to those in need. Tell me, do you believe I was saved by Andraste at the Temple of Sacred Ashes? I should much like to believe so, Your Worship. The miracles Andraste performed were so long ago, they're difficult to picture. If it were truly her and the Fate who saved you... Well, in any case, many already believe you walk in the Maker's Light. Let's speak later. Goodbye.